Clean, anyone following you? No. No? What do you mean, no? Yes? I have a friendly face. Delivers to the Navy Yard. Alles in Ordnung, Horst? Du, nimm nicht so viele Kissen, sonst merken die, dass etwas nicht stimmt. Ja, ja. They supply the torpedoes to all the Nazi U-Boats in Europe. You will hide in the torpedo. Horst will slip it back into main supply. And you will wake up on a U-Boat for breakfast time. Once we have a U-Boat, we take it to set secret safekeep, yeah? <laughs> you sailors, get in the way. Bang, bang, all the pup. <laughs> Come on, man. I'll fuck the pig, you just hold the ears. Okay, career Johnny. Get in the torpedo. Once you board the U-boat, patch this thing into the communication room and raise the antenna buoy. We need radio contact. The dark dreams seem to fade. Too far out of reach. For now, I just miss the light.
Captain Blazkowicz, this is the Eva's Hammer, the crown jewel of the Nazi U-boat fleet. There's a nuclear cannon on this boat. Uh, correction, our nuclear cannon. Some backbone on this here magnificent fucking U-boat, Captain. I'll give him that. Took the decryption keys to the nuclear cannon to his grave. It won't fire? Not the nuclear warheads, no. There I was, planning to ram a big proper atom bomb down Deathset's throat. So let's find decryption keys. The actual physical nuclear decryption keys are not kept on planet Earth. They're stored in the Nazi lunar base. You all captains are required to learn them by heart. Well, the lunar base is the most secure facility the Nazis have. It's where they do all their top secret research these days. What's your point? Uh, Caroline and Anya are working on a bucket HQ. In the luck, we are here. My father taught me this rhyme as a child. There are many other songs for different places. Oh, I know Cockadoodle Day. You found it all open sometime. You should move out of the way. Move. Oh, fuck me in the head. Can you feel the, 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 the air rumbling? This entryway hasn't been used for centuries. Step inside. Mr. Blazkowicz, please, take us inside. Very good. How do you kindle the stage? Let's get the show on the road. I tell you, I have waited for this moment. Mm, there was many among us who wanted to even the balance of the war. But things happened fast. Our gatekeepers were murdered and some were exiled. Down to yeah, we, we had begun to transfer much knowledge to the governments who fought the Nazis, and there was hope. For the time, there was hope, until the Nazis dropped the atom bombs. Well, there was no hope then. I, I remember when the Das Juchet would gather in places like this, it was brimming with life, and <clears throat> the channels of nature was open, but now... Now, I think we may be the last to visit. Ah, here we are. But let me see. Warning! Blah, 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 blah. Bobby Meister, just step inside. Yeah? There's a transition chamber to main hall. Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean, warning? Yeah, warning, warning. The instructions are old and faded. Let's go. This we used to get to the main hall. I don't recognize these symbols. Oh, let me... You should go next there, Blazkowicz. I'll come... Secret vault out there. Now, first, we need to activate magnetic fields and create an entryway. Uh, this machine here, it controls the electromagnetic fields. Yes. Mm. Okay, are you ready, Ingele? One, two, three, go! There, 
This is Das Yichud Prism to make your laser beam attuned to the proper frequency. And you should be able to charge the magnetic coils. You see them? It's, it's up there. I will work to get this thing going. No, Yingle. Tell me, Seth Roth is not a genius. Gentlemen, this is it. Go ahead, look around. Anything that is useful to you, you may take. Just remember, you are in a sacred space. Oh, I got you. Hello, Mark. Thanks ever so much for the new socks. They're right warm and a snug fit. Yeah, I'm doing well. Although uh, this war has grown a little wearisome. Nothing much of interest ever happens around these parts. Today I landed a helicopter on a nicked Nazi nuclear submarine aircraft carrier, after which I donned a deep water diving suit, swam down an abyssal trench in the middle of the Atlantic fucking ocean. Don't mean to bore you with the details. Long story short, I'm now standing inside a secret vault full of things so magical and abnormal in nature the mind has no recourse but to shudder in bewilderment. Of course, I'm accompanied by a Nazi-killing lunatic and some kind of genius wizard who claims to be on a first-name basis with God Almighty himself. Oh, well, we can only hope for a more stimulating turn of events in the future. Uh, people have to have one back. Roger. I'm sufficiently impressed. Come in. Come in. Hey, uh, what you got, Caroline? We have a lead on those decryption keys for the nuclear cannon. Anya, it's a troop transport train recalled from the African front. On board is the chief research scientist for Death's Head's later generation super soldat program. He's leaving for the Nazi lunar base tonight to oversee the launch of the new super soldat. We intercept the troop transport train, locate the chief research scientist, steal his identity and use it to permit Blaskovich to take his seat on the lunar shuttle. Once you're at the lunar base, you need to find the nuclear decryption keys and bring them back to Earth. How to intercept a high-speed Nazi troop transport train? Best side will be the Gibraltar Bridge. Okay, yeah, okay, but how? Set, any ideas? We can use this one. This is very, very powerful. Where, it, it, in English, you couldn't call it I mean, how's the spindly talk? You, you drop this in front of the train, this, this will stop anything. Excellent. Leave right away. That third train is en route. Fuck me. I know what you're thinking, Blasco. No chance. I'm keeping this thing. You give that to Caroline. 